Hello and welcome to Red Gaming Tech for yet more daily gaming news with myself, Amaza. Today is still the 6th of January and I have some more news on the PlayStation 4 and this is a little bit of more sort of speculation a little bit as the analysts Bard and Co have commented on the holiday sales of course the dust is finally beginning to settle after the rush of Christmas and Bard and Co have suggested that the PS4 has taken a slight lead in the US sales and this is despite the issues with the supply now this is at looking through sales at the US retail giant GameStop and the research firm saw that while the PS4 is slightly ahead it's a little bit too early to call it a winner in the battle against the Xbox One and they said quote Sony's PS4 clearly bounced back from our mixed early 2013 supply chain checks and appears to have a slight momentum edge among core gamers as, as demonstrated by premium prices on eBay and persistent out-of-stock reports at retail. And this was from Colin Sebastian, who is an analyst at Bard & Co. And he continued by saying, quote, A competitive two-horse console race would be positive for software publishers and retailers, and if Microsoft and Sony are forced to compete aggressively for market share. And he also said that he expects GameStop to rely heavily on hardware sales in the first half of the year, and this is due to low margins on used software as well as a light release schedule for the first few months of 2014. And this does seem to coincide with similar figures from Amazon that shows a slight lead for the PS4. Now, it is far, far too early to start talking about winners of battles at this stage, as of course we've only really just begun the next generation, and it's going to be a while before we finally see who the quote-unquote winner is, and to be honest, that's not going to real, real, really know the winner, excuse me, until a few years down the line, just like with the PS3 and Xbox 360, the final, final winner won't be decided until then, but the launch window winner, well, even that we won't know until the next few months, so it's far too early to start calling winners, but at this stage of the race, the PS4 does have a slight lead. But of course, the Xbox One will be releasing in more territory soon, as well, the same with the PS4. So it's going, definitely going to be a close race, as I've said quite a few times before. It's not going to be a smash and grab for either company. Uh, I'd be very surprised if any com either of them win by a landfall or anything like that. It's pretty much neck and neck at the moment, and I expect it to remain so for quite some time. Still, I'd be curious to think, who do you think will actually end up winning the quote-unquote console war, and why do you think it? And just saying it's my favourite console is not a good enough answer. Um, just be curious to any reason, particular reason you think that one console may win over the other, in terms of sales figures anyway. Anyway, that is me done for this video. Hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.